Hi everyone, Olishino here and welcome back to another episode of Tuesday Thoughts. So I'm going to be sharing my thoughts today, you know, about what obviously everybody in the world is talking about right now, COVID-19. Over the weekend, I saw a word trending on Twitter especially, the word covid -19. Now these people fall into three categories. The first type of covid are those who at this point still don't believe this is real, who, who are saying this is still fake or it is a hoax or it is an avenue for the government to siphon money or to to create panic or to create fear or to you know a lot of things have been going on on social media someone some people are saying it's an avenue for the government to inject everybody and to kill some certain people in as much as i understand you know i respect their opinion and uh, everybody has a right to their own opinion but if you believe those people you are putting yourself and you are putting others at risk as well this is real people are dying countries with well developed healthcare systems are currently overwhelmed. The earlier we accept what is happening now and take necessary steps and measures, the better for us. The next category of COVID-19 are those who at this moment are doing something very terrible. Those who are stockpiling and those who have seen this as, a, as an opportunity to make a lot of profit. And if you're a shop owner or a store owner who is at this point doing so any of those things, jacking up your prices even despite the fact that you are still selling from most stuff. I think this is a bad attitude and this must stop and you are a covid idiot. Let us once think about those who are having sleepless nights for us to get out of this. Those who are putting their lives on the line. Those who are so, the so-called, you know, front line. Those who will not be able to do all the shopping when you are doing it. Those who will not be able to sleep as much as you are at this point. Because they are working and working their at night, working their asses also that everyone gets better and we all eradicate this. And then the last category, but definitely not the least, are those who believe that they are immune at this point are not practicing the social distancing measures. If you think you are immune or if anybody has told you you are immune because you belong to a particular religion or because you pray in a particular way, it is, a, it is false, it is a lie. Priests, nurses, pastors, imams, and fathers have died. So these two graphics shows you how important it is to practice social distancing and you know self-isolation when you are sick or don't go out when you don't need to. And we can see how much that has led to the reduction in terms of number of people infected and which will eventually turn in, in the amount of people that will eventually die from the COVID-19. So just to round up my thoughts now, the First Minister of Scotland, Nicola Sturgeon, was talking a few days ago and she said, life should not feel normal at this point. And if your life feels normal at this point, you are definitely not doing the right thing. So we all have to make sacrifices for yourself, for your loved ones. Abide by the rules. Stay at home when you don't have to go out. Avoid any social gatherings at this point. Obey the rules set up by the governments and the authorities. Even if you believe you are strong and you know you are young and you are healthy and you don't have any underlying condition, think of people who are not as strong as you are. Think of people who you record come in contact with, who might not know they have even have any underlying condition. Just think of others at this point. This is a test of our humanity and we must at this point be ready to pass that test. Let's all stay positive. Good news is coming out of China. I think they've really cut down drastically on the amount of visits they're having each day now and they're about to close a lot of hospitals. So that is a sign that we cannot get over this if we take the right measures. Let's just all think of others. Don't be selfish. Don't be irresponsible. And above all, don't be a COVID -19. Thanks for watching. Make sure to check out my other videos on this channel. And if this video, if you find this video helpful in any way, please smash that like button and also tap on the subscribe icon so you guys see other videos when I put them up. See you next Tuesday. Bye.